So how would you undo an iPhone update? Let's talk about it and let's get started. If it's your first time on the Fox Tech channel, consider becoming part of the community by subscribing and therefore you'll not miss anything important. Okay, so if you have installed an update on your iPhone, obviously you can see it in your settings, the general and a software update. There isn't any way in here to go one version back. Okay, it, it works, but not through the iPhone, because you can check out a website through Safari, which is called IPSW.me. And this is basically for the software updates for all of the Apple devices. So you can go for the iPhone right here, just go through the uh, specific device model. So just pick that option and you can technically download even older versions of the iOS. Right. So through this website, you can download like the installation file of the older iOS version. But you can see we have the signed IPSWs and unsigned IPSWs. And it generally means that those which are unassigned cannot be installed on the iPhone anymore. But those which are signed can still be installed. And it's possible that an older version is still signed like that. Right. So it just means that if you can find an older version of the iOS, you can download it to your computer. Your computer is necessary. Then you can connect your phone through a cable and either use iTunes or Finder and install it through this file, right? So it can technically undo the update by downgrading to an older version of iOS. It's not the easiest thing and it's probably not recommended for the majority of people, but it is, you know, possible. Technically it works like this if the IPSW is still signed. So yeah, I just quickly wanted to explain that, how it works. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you actually plan on doing that, but thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe for more explanations and videos like this one, and I'll talk to you later.